As McQueen with a chance scores. Roger McQueen. And it's 9 6. Breaks up two on one early here. McQueen works it and shoots, scores. Nine seconds. They'll make it 10 in. McQueen. Plays it to McQueen. Back to Malyevin at the top. Over for McQueen for a one timer. Huey the shoulder save. Hadlin bats it home. Caleb Hadlin on a midair. And the seal is broken on 2023 24 in style. Well, the weak oh, Checked by Rorsma before he could break out. Right to McQueen at the right circle. Shot save. Rebound score. Ryland Rorsma right to the paint. And it's 2 0 Wheat Kings early. Well, it's a bit of a common denominator, too. They will come out to play it. Left behind for Vaughn. He overskated the puck. It's back out for McQueen. Scores! Two assists. Why not tack on a goal? Roger McQueen makes it 3 0 after a miscue behind the Pats net. Oh, I gotta tell you what, Roger McQueen, you know, we talked about him in the pregame as a guy that we're looking to see. Yeah, are quick to the rebounds. Looking to center, deflected in front, and they score Rosma to McQueen. Jousting for it, comes up with the puck, sends it out front. Rosma holds, sends it back door, scores! This line's chemistry is unstoppable right now. Rosma to McQueen to the back of the net, and the Wheat Kings lead by one. Rosma up the right side, busting in with speed at the right circle. Rosma trying to cut it back up front for McQueen, scores! They're unstoppable, and McQueen just keeps knocking them home. 4-1, Wheat Kings. Well, speed through the neutral zone is the key here. And Back to the Rose. top, Shipley, fresh off the bench, shoots and he sailed it wide. Rebound for McQueen, scores! What hand eye by Roger McQueen, he bunted it. Maybe the Blue Jays could use him. 15-19 <laughs> to go in the first, and the Wheat Kings are up 1-0 on some sweet hand eye coordination by Roger McQueen. And you know what a good picking up. Now Smith in some trouble. McQueen picks it up with a puck, fires it and scores. Went short side. Low. At the far circle, the shot from there, a high shot off the glove, off a high stick and in, and immediately the referee indicates no goal, and Ratzlap gives the same indication that there's no goal here. We're going to probably take a look at this the one. King's net is stolen away by Roarsma. Lead pass for Peter. He finds a man in a breakaway. Here's Roger McQueen in on a backhander. He scores. Roger McQueen dangles out Tyler Palmer just 16 seconds into the third period and the Wheat Kings have knotted it up. He'll dance at the left circle. Down for Danielson in the far corner, waiting for Elaine. Danielson back up front, they score! Roger McQueen right on the doorstep and we're tied with 11-17 left in the first. You know, good hockey sense by top. Roger McQueen. Man tied to Peter, slap pass across for Danielson for a shot save, rebound, score! Roger McQueen on the doorstep again. Second night in a row, he scored from within a stick length of the paint on the power play. Rorsma walking into the left circle over to Peter. Back in the middle, McQueen scores! Left side to right side to left to back of the net. It's Roger McQueen tying the score on a tic-tac goal. And tied down the boards for Peter in the left corner. Peter sends it back door for McQueen, scores! Roger McQueen at the mouth of the crease. And the Wheat Kings have the lead for the first time since the opening frame. Well, Dominic Peter And now it's intercepted and taken over the line. McQueen, he's got a partial breakaway in front, and he scores. He deeks it around Aaron Krestinovich and tucks it in past Ewan Huey as he came straight off the bench and found the loose puck and scores to make it 2-0 Brandon with 11.21 to go in the second. Back to Manti, the left point to Peter at the right circle for a shot, scores! Roger McQueen with his stick on the ice and another cold streak snaps for the walleye. They're up 2-0, three and a half into the first. Well, just great puck movement by the walleye. Left Highland spots the trailer McQueen. McQueen fires, save, rebound, score! Nate Danielson cashes in from close range and the Wheat Kings have their first lead of the night. Comes back and wins the puck for Highland. At the left circle, Highland walks it back up front for McQueen. A shot, scores! Roger McQueen drives the net and the big guns come alive for the Wheat Kings to stretch their lead to three. You know, Matt Henry made a line change and Brett Highland jumped on. To the line the and out. Sandra Kang tried to dump it in, but hit McQueen. He'll break back up the near side. One on one with Price. McQueen shoots, saved by kicking, and he looked behind him, scores! McQueen leaked it through. That heavy shot practically went through the Rockets logo on Kickinen. And the Wheat Kings are suddenly up by a pair. Well, a great goal to the right side, Peter. Cross ice, McQueen scores! It's now 4-2 Brandon as they answer on the power play. 16-14 to go. Danielson right up the middle for McQueen at the right circle. McQueen pulls the trigger, shoulder save, rebound way high in the air, they score! Nate Danielson ties us up at two with a buck 21 to go in the third.
after all the passes, all the puck at his own right circle. Looking across ice, picked off by McQueen. He'll carry over the line right up the middle. McQueen making a move between his feet, driving it back to the front of the net. They score! What a pass by Roger McQueen! And it's Hayden Wedden cleaning it up in front to stretch the lead to 3-1. Wow, great to see Hayden Wedden getting his stick on that puck and putting it in his second goal. Dixon drives to his left to McQueen at the left circle with room to walk in. McQueen pulls the trigger off the shoulder at High Highland, bats it home. It's another power play goal for the Wheat Kings. It's another bunt goal for the Wheat Kings. We've seen a bizarre number of those this year as Highland makes it 6 nothing. Brandon. Well, I was going to say, you know, uh, the Wheat Kings. Yeah, the Bruce and Andre Malieven both up and ready to rejoin the fray as here comes Roger McQueen, drop the shoulder, busts the net on his forehand, he scores. A dazzling rush there from Roger McQueen and he finishes it off. It's 2 nothing, Brandon. While well, using his reach to full effect as he's going from his left to right. To and drawing. Over the line, back to McQueen, galloping into the far corner. McQueen works it back up for Highland, a shot, scores! I thought Woodski got a piece of it, but Highland's got a pair. And the Wheat King power play is clicking along here in the second period. Well, Roger McQueen does a great job taking the puck in on the outside, into the zone. He wraps round the corner and carry after it. Johnson works it back up for McQueen. McQueen fires, scores! Roger McQueen on the setup from Nick Johnson and the Wheat Kings lead is two once again with 7.39 to go McQueen, in the McQueen, he'll skate up with it. On the near side, the big Saskatoon product leaves it. Highland shoots, scores. 4-3 Wheat Kings and it's Brett Highland. A minute seven into the hockey game. It's squeak. They'll bring it to the Moose Jaw blue line. Little drop pass there from McQueen, scores! Just as we get back to even strength, Roger McQueen. We'll get the Wheat Kings on the board. That's what happens. You don't get the, the best effort off the power play. And as you said, Highland does, does a great job on the penalty kill. That's Walt Baumuller to the right circle. Shipley looking back door. McQueen scores as the Wheat Kings back to back goals have their first lead of the series. Yeah, you can see that developing from up here. It goes from left side across we'll get to up the, the right. Wheat Kings push up ahead. McQueen. Down the near left wing, works in front, scores! Through a poke check, Roger McQueen has extended Brandon's lead as they're up four to two. And Moose for Alec again. Alec loads and fires through traffic, redirected, there score! It it's Roger McQueen again! His fourth goal in three games, and the Wheat Kings get a shot in the arm early in the third. Again, it's just, it looks like a harmless shot coming from the blue line, but Roger McQueen cutting in front of the net. And